Hello everybody and welcome back to a new episode of Darksiders 2. In the last episode we took a peek into the Crucible um, and did the first 20 waves of said Crucible. Um, I got told in the comment section below that the chest that we got uh, wasn't bugged but it can happen that they do contain nothing because they are randomized. So all fine there. Um, uh, I think I already said that in the last episode, but uh, of course there are 25 wave, uh, waves uh, that you can do. So we could have done five more and we would have gotten a talisman that enhances our life. Uh, we will get that even though it is pretty useless. But yeah, at wave 25 I think there should be Gorewood as a mini boss, But uh, we weren't suited for this yet. Now... What we have to do is head onwards to the um, to the arena through this door that we just arrived to continue with the story. Oops, wrong. Wrong, wrong, wrong. But yes, yeah, thank you for your feedback. Always appreciate it. Um, I, uh, it. It has been a few years since I last played through this game. So if I miss stuff or get stuff uh, wrong, which can of course be the case, then please don't hesitate to tell me so I can correct myself. Um, oh, you are so beautiful. Is boys ah they are so cool um but yeah don't take this as a as a guide or something because as i said i will not do 100 percent i will try to get everything that i can um but i do this from memory mostly uh, except for my two lists here uh let me see so there is a page there and Ostagoth. Hey, hey, boy. Where's the page? Page. Nice. Thank you. Uh, let me quickly check that off my list here. Uh, Gilded Arena outside. So there it is. Bams. Uh, Ostagoth. Hello. What are you doing? I have wares aplenty. Have coins to spare. Mm. How did you get here? A merchant knows many roads. Not all of them are shared with horsemen. Hmm. Great. Rows to your heart's content. Uh so yeah, here's all of the stuff. Uh let's see, we can maybe sell some stuff that we don't need, like these. Oh. Do we have yes, any useless... Use of this. Oh yeah, um, I don't know if I already showed this to you or if I did this after at the end of the last part, but um, I have these possessed scythe now. They are all the way upgraded. Um, and yeah, now we should be all good. To go um, they had piercing damage on them when I got them so they now have critical chance of 18 uh, critical damage of 25% and health on crit is 37 so they have more crit chance and more health on crit but a bit less critical damage than the ones we uh, were using before oh yeah we can now use these don't know if we if I showed you these before they look awesome but uh yeah possessed weapons is mostly the way to go um if we continue to level up we can use the mace maximus that i already read the text of but what i forgot to tell you is that it is indeed a possessed legendary weapon um that we can upgrade which is pretty damn good uh yes so let me see uh i also changed from the 
our glaive back to the scaled axe because it has a really good crit chance as well as the lifesteal effect which is nice and it did more damage so i decided to use it uh gilded arena so let's see what this is all about i have to be wary though because there are uh there is one more page inside here and there is three artifacts so yeah a lot to collect and also this pretty obvious stone Ugh. <laughs> Ba -ba -ba. Sorry if my commenting is a bit off today. I have a terrible headache. I just took some medicine, but it's not gone yet. So, uh, yeah. I hope it does get better soon. I don't know where to go first, to be fair. I think this should be... Yeah, this is the way to go. So we will go down. First. To see what is hiding down here. Uh, there are f s s uh, numerous of the uh, of dungeons that are laid out like this uh, in this world. So that you have a spiral staircase down and they are way bigger than they seem at first because most of it is underground. Ah, this is a door to the outside. I see. Okay. I get it. But it's locked, right? Yes. Okay, it's locked. Oh, no. There's a lever. Okay. Let's quickly open this up. Yeah, so these big ominous doors are always ways to get outside. Right? Right, okay. We don't want to go here. We will go there later. <laughs> okay, back up we go then. Uh, ba, 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 ba. <laughs> oh, I'm still using the wrong weapon here. Better. <clears throat> okay, yeah, so this is a new element in many riddles and um, that you have to solve here in the second world which they use these um, these lanterns that have a beacon of light and you have to point these at the um, at those crystals this uh, is known from the first game because it already was a part there but it looks a bit different uh, there sh is a chest below we will get you real quick boots uh critical damage oh nice okay um i also thought about maybe changing my gear um to go on the arcane builds that i want to use later already but i uh, decided against this because for now we are good with the crit heal uh, crit heal combo that we are running so yeah the our our thighs are now not optimal because they don't have an element i always like to have an element for example shock is really really good on the main weapon uh, I think because you can apply it with a lot of fast attacks and it will stagger enemies oh. Behold, a 
Does he see absolution from death? No. This one yet lives. Quiet. You would tell us his cause. Speak, challenger. I'm here to defeat your champion. And so all challengers boast that most leave in torment. Their souls burn from existence. Their dark champion, the more the stronger for it. Enough! Bring out your champion. <sighs> yes. There is power in this one, power enough to do as he claims. But our champion is no cur to be summoned at will. You must draw him forth. This altar holds his power. The souls of all he has slain and consumed. Three animal stones must be placed therein. And our champion. Hmm. Uh, yeah. So, this is what I already said. You see this big head over there? We have to place three life stones <laughs> into this one to summon the champion to and then to kill it. Sounds familiar? Yes, because it is. <laughs> because it is the same as it was with the Guardian. But now we do know that we have to kill him after we summoned him. So let me see here. Uh, Gilded Arena second floor is a page. Uh, Hangstone central... There from Eternal Throne. Okay, I s it seems. Oh no, I this one I can get after we had an audience with the king. Okay, so let's see. Uh, let's look around in this main room first uh, because they are now all facing in this direction and these fires are lit. So this is the way to go for the first lifestone. Um. If you are ever missing the way and wondering where to go. But there is stuff to collect all around this place. And I hope we do manage to find it all. Uh, let me see. I can go up. What? Huh. Oh, okay. I see. Up there. Hello. Hello, hello. Oh, and the tree in the background again. Uh, come on, grab it. Mm, nope. But I see something over there. Ooh. There is a relic of Renagor. Nice. This should be the central one. I do hope. <laughs> Let's see, there's a chest hiding somewhere around here on the other side. How do I get on the other side? This is a mystery. Ah, okay. No, it's not. <laughs> it's easy. No, 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 no. So we will, of course, get you. Give us something good. No. Oh, boots as well. Hmm. They all suck. So let's check out the other side. Um, also, real quick. And then we head towards the first lifestone. Um, through these tunnels you get uh, something just get down to the to the main arena here 
or up because you can jump down or if you ever fall down there you can get back up by using these so let's see is there anything of interest around huh i heard a door There's a chest here also, isn't there here? Mm -hmm. mm, can I get up there? I bet I can, but I don't know how. How, how, how? Uh, ba, 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 ba. No, doesn't seem to be the case though. Then I guess this is it. Okay. So yeah, we will just go around. Let's go down into the main. Oh, no, nope. never mind. There's no need for that. Hoopa, hoopa. And then we have to go up again like this. Come on, please. Thank you. Uh, ba, ba, ba. We'll just continue through the arena and its dungeons, and if we happen to find uh, stuff, we will. Oh. oh, good. Am I back up? Oh, thank you. I better than climbing back up because I want that chest, of course. Like this. But I think, I do think I remember where the... Okay, this is just the way up. I think I remember the page. And we will just get by it on our way. If I do remember correctly. Okay, this is just our doom. Oh, wait. Is this already? No. Um, so yeah, in the past, I always spent a lot of time breaking all of these... Um, uh, all of the boxes and crates around. And the tombstones. Um, you should... There are a few... Uh, there, there are secrets where you have to break all of the tombstones in one room. Um, but this is not one of them. You will get gold though, so if you really want to, you can. But they are a bit tricky to hit sometimes. And there is a lot of them. So, a lot. I mean a lot. Sometimes it's in the walls and stuff, it's uh, a bit hideous. So uh, yeah, let's see. Oh. Hey there, what's up? Okay, let me, Aua. let me get my ghouls, please. I want to do the combo. Wrong one. Wrong one again. I managed to do it though, but they were all dead already. Okay, now the warriors. So a bit stronger skeleton there. Ow, ah, stop hitting me. This is rude. Wham. Ah, oh, this is a lot of enemies. Hey. Ah, but no problem. Wait, up. Up. <laughs> uh, but, but, but. So let's see here. Um, 
And yeah, because we are using the the um, the weapon mastery talisman, we can, uh, if we with this weapon do the charge attack right, he will lift it will lift us up in the air and give us more possibilities for combos, which is nice. Okay, there's a coin, kilo coin. Uh, and we have to get over there to get this. So our goal is to get the the lantern of the statue. So so that we can go somewhere, I guess. Oh yeah, so that we can put it on top of this. Oh, should we be able to? Yeah, we can grab this with our death grip and bomb this three over oh well it counted anyways half of it <laughs> but it's enough so let's see boots bibidi babidi boots okay 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 so we will get you and bomb this lantern over there we should be able to pick this up with our death grip as well nice and now we can place this onto here and just leave it there for the moment and now we are able to go over here and cycle around and we need this lantern right here because this statue is missing one. So, how do we get it? Go up here. We press this very small lever. The, the button. The lever button. And then we grab the lantern off of it. And there we go. Because you can't... Oh, okay, you can jump. But you can... Can't wall run, of course. So it's always a question about uh, of uh, moving them around. So let's see. This one we can't open using the beacon. But the other one should be no problem. Yes. Now this is open. Okay, let's see. Where are we? There's a hole here. This, there's the... Um, there's the stone. So let me check. Okay, do you think we get back from there? So let's just go pick up the stone. Hello. Uh, always those skeletons up there, there in their cages. Thinking they are boss. <laughs> Nice. First one done done. All done. Animus stone. A stone imbued with the power to breathe life into sleeping horrors. One of three stones required to resurrect the arena champion. Yes. Sounds like a description straight out of a Lovecraft story. Uh, oh, there's a stone. I did not hear that one. Maybe I was just stupid. Bugs. Oh, more bugs. Yay. Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> and that's it. So I bet if you ever have a problem with mosquitoes, you can just pull out your gun and shoot them, maybe. <laughs> ah, now this does open. Um, okay, these symbols. 
right here they uh there is a side quest where there is a labyrinth in this game and it's in this second world uh these symbols here um tell you that there is a um a sheet um nearby that you can pick up that tells you uh that gives you a hint of where you need to go inside the labyrinth that you can collect all of them but i will not do this i will do the labyrinth but i will simply look it up the combination so the ways to go so i will not go collect all of these um, but of course we will do the labyrinth uh, in time but yeah just so you know uh, these symbols just tell you hey you can find a scroll around or a, no 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 not a scroll but a hint so there there is the hint uh, this would be west west northeast um, now we get the uh, the scroll soul arbiters uh, Arbidus scroll follow these coordinates to escape the soul Arbidus maze west west northeast so you can find all of these and then you have them in your inventory and you can look them up but as i said we will just i will just pick them up on the internet and we will do them because they are always the same so no problems or worries there this should be the map right Uh, bu -bu -bu. okay, up we go. Shut up. Uh, is there? There's just a staircase behind us, so we should go over here, jump this up, and yeah, this um, this lever just puts us back where we came from down in the main pit and it closes behind us always so yeah there it is just put it in one done two to go And all that okay this was quick but this opened uh, a path where we can go through to get up of course thank you let's see i think there should be no real secrets inside these tunnels but i am not 100 percent certain i see that there is a chest in the middle but we can't exit um, we can't enter there yet this will be a chest for another time so now they turn their heads into this direction right here uh where was the way up oh wow okay now there are enemies roaming around the place Good, 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 good. Okay. Again, the door. Which door is this? Always at the same place. Hm. Weird. Okay, so now we go through. Okay, this is blocked. This is open. Uh, this can be opened, but we can't do anything there yet. So, we will just go right here for now. Uh, I think this chest is on the other side, right? Yeah. Okay. So, we can't get this yet either. 
so let's just follow the path. Uh, okay, yeah, big bridge riddles and stuff. We will do this in the next episode. So this was the beginning of the Gilded Arena and it will probably take us to the next um, one or maybe two episodes to complete this. Uh, I really hope you did enjoy, uh, enjoy this episode. If you did, please consider leaving a like and give me tips or let me know your opinion in the comment section below. If you didn't already do so, please consider subscribing to my channel and turn on the notifications so that you guys won't miss any future episodes that I upload. I really hope to see you in the next one and until then, bye bye.